having something incredibly interesting, but even more interesting is Chef Adekpeju Ruth. Now, she's joining us in the Wake Up Nigeria kitchen this Monday morning. She has something special to prepare for us. <laughs> yes. Welcome. Thank you. All right, so what is it you call this particular dish? We call it village suya rice. Village suya rice. rice. Yes. Mm. Okay, so there is a trend <laughs> of village rice recipes coming about now yeah. um, because I feel like it's a one-pot kind of dish and uh, it seems very simple to prepare. Those are the ingredients on the screen there. Of course, we have the rice, tomatoes, pepper, onions, suya spice, palm oil, vegetable oil, seasoning, crayfish, assorted meat, and prawns. Interesting. Okay. Thank you. All right. Okay. So this is a leaf, a special yeah, leaf, leaf. Yeah, right? This is a banana leaf. Banana leaf. Yeah, and this is what we use in serving the rice. Okay, so you're going to serve the this rice. meal directly on really top of this banana leaf. leaf. Yes. Interesting. All right, let's talk about the ingredients and what's already happened to the okay, ingredients. We have so far. our crayfish, blended okay. crayfish. You blended it yourself? Yes, of course, definitely. Okay, okay. We have our suya. So yeah. this is suya from our guys, you know. Down no, 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 no. This is suya made by me. Ooh. Yeah, this is suya okay. made by me, yes. Nice. Then we have our little local beans. Local beans, yeah. yeah. And we have our um, suya spice. We have our seasoning powder. And we have our tomatoes. Okay. Then we also have our blended tomatoes. We okay. use this for the sauce because the rice comes with sauce. So we're so using sauce. Is this only well. tomato, though? Yes. Only tomato, no yeah. pepper inside? No, there's pepper, but don't lead to. Okay. Not like much because what we have our um, um the pepper we have is the blended is it like tatashe or no, no, no. blended dried pepper. Oh, okay. <laughs> blended, blended dried, dried pepper. Just because of the spice. Okay. Yes. Okay. So Fantastic. we have our blended um, pepper so and tomato okay. for our sauce. Fantastic. Then we have our onions. We have our shrimps. All right. So this is the dried version of the shrimp. Did you yes, rehydrate the it? Did you boil it? Or no, no. Did... I just soaked it. Soaked it. Okay. Overnight. So it could get soft a bit. Fantastic. That's right. All right. Then we have our vegetable oil. Mm. And we also have our palm oil, village oil. So, yes. So, I, I, I was noting that one of the key differences between village rice and jollof is the palm oil. One yes. One of the yes. key differences. Yes, because of the palm oil. The taste okay. of the palm oil is different from the vegetable oil. Of course. Yes. Uh, now, so what's the first thing we need to do? Because I know now, we have some washed rice here yes. now, and some eggs also to boil. Yeah, can I have this? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Just put a little bit of vegetable oil in it. Okay, so directly into the rice. Into the rice. Wow. Okay. Then we stir it together. Oil straight into the rice. Fabulous. Okay. So that's about uh, half a cup of oil there. <laughs> about half a cup of oil yeah. going in. Then we also have our palm oil that comes in with it. Straight in. Directly yes. before we even start boiling the rice. Yes, of wow. course. Ooh. Okay, I'm learning. I'm learning. <laughs> I'm learning, no. Okay, okay. Because I have noted that even my husband is taking an interest to, in this village rice. Village rice. Yeah, so I, I was wondering whether it was the person selling it to me <laughs> that was the issue. But I think, I think I need to start, you know, exploring this village rice thing. So we're using the palm oil to make sure the rice gets into that oil properly. Okay, yeah. all right. Fantastic. So the oil, the two oils go straight in. Go straight in, yes. Then we have our onions. The onions. Yes. They're going Comes in with the onions, yes. All right. So you know they call this village rice. <laughs> yes. But what aspect of it is tr truly makes it village I rice, think, in your opinion? Yeah, it's the palm oil for real. Oh. The palm oil gives it this taste. There is no way. And especially the local beans too. Okay. Give okay. it that taste. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. all right. So we're working on getting the oils mixed into that pre-washed rice with the onions and then we are going to set to work. Hopefully you're trying this at home as well. Use our hashtag Wake Up Nigeria on TVC and let us know exactly. Yes, indeed. It's about time for us to see the next stage in this amazing village rice. Suya village rice. Happy Suya, Suya village, village rice. rice. Yes. Put together by Chef Adekweju Ruth here. Mm. And uh, if you missed the ingredients earlier on, uh, I know we'll be able to give them to you right now. Of course, if you have these lying around your kitchen, you might want to try this out yourself. Rice, tomatoes, pepper, onions, suya spice, of course, palm oil, vegetable oil, seasoning, crayfish, meat, and prawns. Fantastic.
So if you have this at home, or maybe you have some leftover suya from last weekend <laughs> in the fridge, you might, you're wondering, what can I do with this suya? What can I do with all these ingredients? This might be something you want to try. Right. Chef Adikwenju, before we went to a quick uh, sports session there with uh, Mary and Olamide, yeah. we put in the vegetable oil and the palm oil. Palm oil, yeah. Pre-washed rice. rice. With our onions. With the onions. Yeah. So what happens now? Now we're adding the whole thing. First of all, we'll add the prawns. Prawns, yeah, okay. That's what's going to happen. So now. these prawns um, were rehydrated. Yes, of course. Like, should I put the heat on for you now? Uh, yeah, you know, yeah, you can do okay, that. I'm right put the heat on for you now so that we can begin the process perfectly. Aha, so these prawns were rehydrated overnight. Night, yes. Soaked in water. Of course. Because I actually wonder about that sometimes, you know. Um, That's the best way to eat your prawns. Mm. Soaked it overnight. Okay. That's All the right. best way. So yeah, boiling it down is, is, is not enough? No, soak with um, um, cold tom water. Okay. That's okay. the best right. way. Fantastic. Yeah. So the prawns are in now. Yeah, now What's we have next? our suya. Okay, the actual suya. You said yes. you made this yourself. Yes, overnight at the same time. Beef suya. Yeah, beef suya. Mm. And we have um, shaki. We oh. have, look at it, we have shaki. We have gizzard. Gizzard. Little shaki. Gizzard. Okay. Yes. All right. Yeah. So let's go ahead with that now at this point. Yeah. Um, We're adding our crayfish now. Oh, crayfish? Yeah. Go ahead. Blended crayfish. Our little salt. A little bit. Not of much salt. of it. Okay. Put mm. our local beans. All right. Locust beans. Did you yes. do anything to the locust beans at all? No, I just washed it. Okay. That's yeah. Nice. All right. Then we have our suya spice. So, you know, they call it yaji. Some people call it yaji. Yeah, I call but, it suya spice. There's a difference between yaji and there's a difference between suya spice. Hmm, a lot okay. of people don't know that. Okay. Two different. All right, all right, no problem. Yeah. But um, is there ginger in this? Yeah, of course. There's, there's ginger. ginger, there's garlic. Okay. Yeah, dried ginger, dried garlic. And dried pepper? Yeah. Is there any salt in there? No, 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 not at all. No salt? In at all, no salt. Fantastic. Then we have our seasoning. Uh, so is this like a normal stock cube seasoning? Yes, yes, normal one. Okay, all right, yeah. fantastic. So there's no uh, chicken or crayfish no, 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 flavor no, 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 or no, 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 like no, not at all. Okay, mm. usual stock cubes. Yeah. Now we're adding our original suya. <laughs> so now the suya goes in. Goes in, yes. All right. So if I was going to add any other ingredients right now, yeah. like protein type of ingredients. Okay, but fish is better. Fish? Yes. Oh, okay. Fish is what better. What type of fish? Like a jakika? Like you know, fish like or? croaker fish. Interesting. Croaker fish is very, or barracuda. Hmm. Barracuda but would fish. I pre-fry that? Or yeah, you pre-fry. Okay. And when the suya is ready, almost ready, yeah. just put in your fish in it. On top? On top of it. Fantastic. All right. So <laughs> we now, have our tomato. Tomato. Was like tomato, in now? just tomato. Is it going in now? Yeah, of course. Okay. It's real. Everything straight in the dish. Yes. Straight in. All yeah. the spices, all the ingredients. Straight in. We going straight in there now, and we ton 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 ton. <laughs> How much water are we going to add to this? Probably about a cup. Yeah. No, two cup. Two cups two of cup, water yeah. will be going because in. Because we didn't boil the rice. Fantastic. Beautiful. Two cups of water will go in there and we'll put that on the heat. And by the time you see this meal next, uh, Happy Suya Village Rice will be almost set. I know you can't wait because I can't wait either. The amazing aromas here. I the ladies have been busy since because, mm -hmm. I mean, hey, our last guest is always a special guest. So Chef Adepeju Ruth in the kitchen. Yeah. She's made happy suya village rice. Mm. Wow. So that happy, I'm sure you were happy when you sat down. It was, <laughs> when, when they told me I was the last guest on the <laughs> show, I was like, I knew something was going to come out of it. Wow. So, <laughs> she said something was going to come out. I know, I know something was coming out, so. All right. I'm happy to, you mm. know. Is everything okay? So we're actually, the, so the aroma is, is affecting everybody here. We need you to taste it. <laughs> Tell the world what it tastes like, please. Go ahead, please go ahead. <laughs> this is gonna be good because I can already oh, see. Yes, yeah, so please, sauce, I always do go ahead, go ahead, please, go ahead sauce. right now, please. <laughs> Tell go us ahead. already, yeah, we can't wait. Suspicion <laughs> is killing us. <laughs> All right. <laughs> mm. It's hot. So what do you think? 
What do you think? I want to say something. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Ah. <laughs> I watched the show. Okay. Um, this guy was here. Who? In the studio. Then really. Oh, okay. That's a while ago. <laughs> yeah. And he ate. Uh, they gave him food. Okay. You know what he said? What, what did I... he say? He said that waka we welu. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. A fabulous way thank you. Thank you so to very start much. our Monday. Yes, indeed. We're going to catch you guys again tomorrow for tomorrow's show, Tuesday edition at 7 a.m. Wow. Thank you for joining us for today. Make sure you stay with us all through the end of the week. Yay. Until we see you tomorrow. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye.